Hey YouTubers, it's Mark from True Seeker, and I'm in Soul 692. And this right here drew my attention immediately. When I look at it, I could see there's an eye carved here. There would be the nose. You could see the structure of the, you know, the head comes down. Here's a mouth. Then here's the body. It comes down to the legs. I believe that there's some type of base here that's blurred out. Um, either this thing is meant to lay flat or it's toppled over for whatever reason. And you can see that there's uh, like this piece here. There's a piece that comes up and then there's a piece that comes out. I mean there's a lot of weird structure in this in this soul. A lot of things that just doesn't don't make sense. You know, if you believe what we've been fed to believe that nobody's ever been on Mars or alive there, and a lot of this stuff that I show you guys is basically impossible. It's magic. You know, either they're not on Mars and they're adding these anomalies. You know, if you believe what NASA is telling you, that nobody's ever been on Mars. Which, I know not to be true. I've known it for a long time. I mean, to me, this just looks like either it's a carved out statue. You know, that's the eye, it's the head. You can see there's a little piece that's carved into the back. I don't know if it's some type of... Uh, is this a ceremonial statue? Is this a grave marker? I mean, who only knows? But you can see there's an eye. That would be the mouth. And the body comes down. I believe there's another part here that's blurred. You see this, I call it spaghetti. That's the mess that they just put around this stuff. A lot of times the real darker stuff gets through for some reason. Like here. This looks like to be a circle with some type of holes in it. Okay, here it comes up. Here it looks to be another statue. You see that would be the eye, the nose, the mouth. Yeah, it almost looks like stuff like you'd see at Easter Island or you know. I usually don't like equating this stuff to certain areas. But, uh, I mean, it's really the kind of stuff you would see there. So, I mean, look at the structure, and that comes up, comes over, there's a circle underneath. These are, this is real stuff under here. It's just that they, I believe there's different layers, and, uh, Chris from Mars Anomaly says the same thing, too. And uh, Will from What's Up in the Sky 37. And, you know, these are guys that are really on their game. You know, when it comes to Mars research, and you know, they these guys say that they're they're working with different layers, and I believe they're just blurring certain layers. And see, like this piece here. See how they just blur it out. See how this is just blurred. This is blurred. And then you'll come to certain parts of the photo where, you know, it's perfect. All right, there's a couple other things I want to show you real quick. Come over to this area here. See how it looks like there's weird carvings in this rock? squares with holes in them. I mean, it's hard to tell unless you're really paying attention. Because they make everything these, just like these bland colors and then they distort it a little. Like this piece that comes up. See how they put this blur right here? You can see that there's a circle carved in there. 
and it comes up that they see that's where they put this blur. That's what I mean about certain, see like this is perfectly clear and then you go back to these other parts of the photo like I was just showing you where they start burying it in that fake sand. Only this piece, how it stands out. I mean, to me, it looks like some type of metal. And you see the piece behind it here. See, I don't take this to be a rock. Any of this, I think it's just filled in. See, this piece here. See, I believe they fill this stuff in to look like rocks. See how this has got pipes coming off of it? There's another one. See how it's got like some type of pipe coming out of it? Sorry about that. See now to me that's this is an artifact. This is a real. What it is, God only knows, but that's a real Martian artifact as far as I'm concerned. And a lot of what's around it, I believe, is just filled in. Like there's certain parts, like, see how they put this bluish haze? See over here where this gets interesting? See how this piece is interesting? See how it's got this haze? They just fill it in, I, I believe, to make it look like rocks. But when you zoom into the picture, like I do, I enlarge it, it just really stands out. Now, here's another piece. See how they put this blur on the side of it? There's some type of. Uh, looks like some type of rectangular box with. Uh, two pipes coming out of the top of it. Let's see how close I can get you in here. See what I'm talking about? Yeah. Come on. Uh, it has, that's just not happening naturally. Go up to your mountains. Anything close to your house. Take a look around. See if you see that lying around. And then we're supposed to believe this nonsense that NASA feeds us. I mean, I, I feel sorry for the people that do believe it. Because it's just, it's hilarious. Just total nonsense. I mean, it's really, it's really time for them to just somewhat come clean. Even if they just, you know, reside to the fact that they tell us, hey, listen, we found something, we're going to investigate it, but we can't tell you anymore right now. And most people would be pretty pretty satisfied with that to start with. And here's another statue. See how it comes up? See it's blurred. See there's the head. There's one eye, the other eye. There's some weird stuff on the top of it. Looks like it's got an arm coming out. And that would be the base. See how they just put that blur? And it all disappears. It just, you know, becomes one. You don't see the shadow underneath it. See, with that fake sand that they put down, it takes away the shadows. So you don't know if something's standing up, it's laying down, unless you really get into the pictures like I'm doing. Like you take something like this, look at there's one, two, look at look at how these holes are just perfect. I mean that's really something that's there, it's just blurred. There's another piece. You know, they just it's just all blurred. Then you come to stuff like this, yeah, they put this black smudge right here. You know, from a distance, if you don't really blow these pictures up, you don't notice. See how they put this smudge here? You don't notice that they're doing that. It just looks like rocks. 
when I first started blowing these pictures up and really getting into this, I was just speechless. Just almost speechless with what I was finding. I just couldn't believe that it was that NASA was doing it to that extent. I thought there might have been a couple small little statues and stuff on Mars, but I, over the you know years, it's just I'm almost convinced that there's a hustling, bustling society there. Have I seen it? No. From what I'm seeing, there's something going on there, and I believe it to be pretty big. You know, especially when you just take one look at Mount Sharp. There's huge structures back there. Machinery, it looks like plants. So, something's up. And this, this took me as to be a little strange because they blurred it out. We'll start with this. Like, this stuff is standing up. Let's see. Some little brass ball. It looks to be a cross, a little small cross behind here. Then you come up to this. Look at this area. There's something here. You can see the shadow. There's like a base. But you can see the different layers. How they're layering this stuff. So yeah, this would be a, uh, a square base with this statue or whatever you want to call it on top of it. Another very strange area. You can see there's some type of relief carvings in here. And this looks to be like maybe like a carved bird. You can see the shadow behind it. Then it comes up the wall. You can see there's more carvings in it. it comes up to about here. And then it comes back down. See, there's more carvings here. See how they just cut this stuff off? You see, it comes over. You can see the beautiful carvings that are in this. Look at that perfect. See how that's perfect? Either it's an entrance or a mausoleum. See how it comes down? Comes across here. And when they make it all one color, it's tough. And unless you're really looking for this stuff, you're not going to see it. back here. See so yeah, this is another one of those S. I found I can't even count how many now. The S E um, S, the letter E, um, zeros or O's, uh, threes. Well, look at look at the carving that's in this. And there's a little something right in there. You gotta be kidding me, NASA. You gotta be kidding me. You want people to believe your nonsense. It's just 
just unbelievable. I mean, this stuff is is right there for us to find, people. All you got to do is take a little bit of time, and this stuff is there. I know it's scary. I, mean, I don't care what anybody says. I know it's scary. First of all, it makes you rethink everything that you've been taught, your religious beliefs. But let me make it simple for you. God created all of this. God created different races of people. Uh, some people are comfortable calling them aliens. To me, they're just people. There's an, it looks like another S. You know, just because they had different shaped heads or bigger eyes or longer arms, different colors. Hey, we have all different races on Earth, so. They all have souls. You know, God created everything. He created this whole universe. He just didn't create this whole universe just to put us here. So, if you want to believe that, then you're a pretty selfish person. You really need to rethink a lot of things. Because that's one of the most selfish things that you could you could really say God created uh, this whole universe just for us that's that's actually being disgusting disgustingly selfish look at this cool stuff in the back here another statue that would be the eye the nose see the mouth comes down there's a base that they blurred there's another little cool statue right in front of it Then you're going to come down to this. This looks like some type of disc. But for whatever reason, they put some black blurring in here, heavy boxing, more black blurring. So there's something here. But I just can't make heads or tails because they just.